It's said that in the 11th century, in the town of Coventry in merry old England, there lived a young nobleman called Leofric, known to his friends as Earl of Coventry. His beautiful young wife, known to her friends as Lady Godiva, and a tailor named Tom, also known as Peeping Tom. Peep. <laughs> It is further said that this guy, Leofric, known to his friends as the Earl of Coventry, used to sing about Lady Godiva, known as his wife. I'm in love with the girl with the long blonde hair that grows and it twines and it circles me in my captive space. A slave to her love as it brushes my face where it hangs from above. I could sit and eat ice cream the day along and stare at that beautiful girl with the long blonde hair. And it weaves in my fingers, comes up between my toes. Like Norwegian silk, wherever it goes, and it trails through my fingers and flies down the hall in long stringy shadows that flicker the wall till I find that the seagull just coasting on air. I'm in love with the girl. Be such heavy taxes on the people of Coventry. If Lady Godiva, ah, <laughs> such a bird. If I want to levy taxes on the people, I'll levy taxes on the people, and you stay out of my hair. Oh, if only there was something I could do to protest this unfair taxation. My lady, why don't you ride through town naked on a horse? <laughs> I know what I'll do. I'll ride through town naked on a horse. You're on. What did I say? Oh, my dear Lady Godiva, you just said you'd ride through the streets of downtown Coventry naked. On a horse. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so an agreement was made between Leo Frick and his Lady Godiva. It was a fair trade. Lower taxes and in exchange for a, for a naked dame on a white horse. The people, hearing of her overwhelming generosity, agreed that not one of them would as much as peep at her noble nakedness. I guess for tax purposes, people will do anything. So I'm going to put my blinders on. Here ye, here ye, naked divers now starting her famous ride through downtown Coventry. Word is that she has a great figure, she's completely naked, and you'll recognize her because she's riding on a white horse. <laughs> so if you see her... So if you see her, don't look, because she's doing it for tax purposes. Peep. Peep, peep. Lady Godiva, you've kept your part of the bargain, and now the taxes, and I say this with great pleasure, I said you've... So, 
you sitting in that barrel peeping through the telescope? You should be ashamed of yourself. I was You, hot. Tom the tailor. You're nothing but peeping Tom. That's I, what you are. I was framed. You weren't framed? Yes, I was. Out of that barrel, right? This instant. Out. Out. Come on. What do you mean? How dare you peeping at Lady Godiva? Don't you realize what she was doing for you? I'm sorry. You're nothing but a peeping creep. I'm sorry, I said. I, I don't want to... It I'm... doesn't matter if you're sorry. You did it. I... Start peeping. You came here to peep. I want you to peep. Peep right now. It's really been a long day. I'm really, I'm really tired. Baby. I don't care how tired you are. I want you to peep now. I'm so ashamed of myself. I'm... Well, I got to tell you, I'm too pooped to peep. <laughs> I've been peeping all the... I mean, I... Been... Yeah! Ah, you just admitted you were the peeper. You know, I'm going to teach you a lesson. You come right out here in the middle of the square, peeping Tom. I don't want to... Sit down. I'm sitting... You're going to peep like you've never peeped before. You... Sit down. Lady Kadiva. You said... Meet, I said I was... Meet Tom the peeper. Hit it, Riddle. I'm Lady Godiva. You peeping creep, you had enough peeping. If I so peep, I'll never peep again. I've never had opportunity to peep this much. I don't really Now you realize how wrong you were. Once you've filled your insatiable desire to peep, you realize how shallow and callow this desire was and how it was the, the destruction of your whole being, right? Well, certainly, you've certainly taught me a question. All right, put your, put your peeping equipment in the sack. I don't want And I hope you never peep again. There, that's every... This is a total cure, I'm yeah. sure. What's that? For looking real, peeping real close. <laughs> All right, is that everything? That's is every that everything? Honest, honest. Look at me, is that everything? Yes, sir, it's everything. I've learned my lesson. I'll never peep again. You'll never peep again. That's right, unless you... On your... You unless... You mean those? Yes. <laughs> Lady Cadaver. I think we've taught that peeping Tom a lesson, you know? Now the taxes shall be lowered, and we'll live happily ever after. Oh, no, we won't. We won't? I'm going with peeping Tom. Peep, peep. You never looked at me the way he does. Peep, peep, peep. He understands my needs. <laughs> I love to be looked at, and he's a great looker. Odds <laughs> 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 boxing, I've been cockled by a peeper. <laughs> And so Lady Godiva left Lord Leofric and went to live with their true love, Peeping Tom. And it is said that they lived happily forever after. Good night, my darling Peeping Tom. I've never been so happy. 